In Microsoft Dynamics 365, you can create product kits. These are the individual products that are packaged into one sellable unit. A product kit consists of kit components and component substitutes. Different combinations of components and component substitutes that are included in a product kit are known as kit configurations. In the Sinov App Store, you can see all product kit configurations on the product details page of a kit in the configuration drop-down list. A customer can check all available product kit configurations and select the necessary one. A customer can click View Package Contents to see all product kit components of the selected kit configuration. Microsoft Dynamics 365 automatically generates the name for each product kit configuration, but you can change it. Now, let's see how to create product kits in Microsoft Dynamics 365. You can create a product kit in the Retail module under Products and Categories. Create a new product kit and enter the required information. When the product kit is created, on the Product tab, click Configure. On the Kit Components Fast tab in the Components grid, add products and product variants to the product kit as its components. You can also adjust the quantity and unit of measure for each kit component that you added. In the substitution grid, you can add product substitutes to the selected kit components. A product substitute can be also a product or a product variant. Different combinations of components and component substitutes that are included in a product kit are known as kit configurations. One product kit can have one or more configurations. After you have added all product components and component substitutes to the kit, click Approve to approve the product kit. Please note, once the product kit is approved, you cannot change its components. When the product kit is created and approved, you need to release the products. In the Release Products window, use the wizard to release all the necessary products. On the first wizard page, check the information about the product you are going to release and click Next. On the second wizard page, select the kit configurations that you want to release and click Next. By default, all configurations of the product kit are selected. On the following page, select the legal entities to which the kit should be released and then click Next. On the last wizard page, configure the necessary settings and click Finish to release the product kit. When the product kit is released, you can find it in the Released Product Kits table. Select the product kit that you have released and on the Product tab click Configure. When the product kit is released, you can see the base price of each kit component and the total base price. The base price of each component is the price of the product. You can specify the new price for each kit component or the total kit price. If you specify the total kit price, the total price is distributed across all products in the kit. The price adjustment to each product is based on the percentage that each product's base price contributes to the total base price of the product kit. 
You can also specify whether there is an additional charge for the product substitutes when the customer selects the product substitute instead of the base component. The additional cost is included when the kit price is calculated. When the released product kit is configured, click Product Dimensions. Microsoft Dynamics 365 automatically generates the name for each product kit configuration, but you can change them. The name of each product kit configuration is shown in the Sign of App Store on the Product Details page of the kit. Thus, you can enter some user-friendly names. You can also add the name of each product kit configuration in different languages. Make sure that all required fields of the released product kit are filled in. Otherwise, it will not be orderable in the Sign of App Store. Validate that all required field values, for example dimension groups, are specified. Don't forget to make the product kit visible in WebShop just like a regular product to make it available in the Sign of App Store.